cheap, steep. Hello. <laughs> How have you been? Do you get it? Been? I get it. Yes. I get it. I get it. <sighs> Don't it feel like things are finally getting back to normal? Look, we're in our kitchen. This is this is <laughs> a usable kitchen. It is. I've got some hair. The lockdown in the England is kind of easing off a little bit in the fact that we're kind of getting uh, we're allowed to see wear family? socks and yeah, see, see family. Uh, and we have an oven that works properly. We have two ovens <laughs> that work. Yes, ladies and gents. Finally, we're not a hundred percent done in here. Look, we don't have any floor. Nope. Mrs. Barry still needs the stool. Things yeah. are back to normal. Yeah. Explain cheap versus steep for people so, that missed it so far. Okay, it's when you have this two versions of the same recipe. Yeah. One from the most expensive supermarket with expensive posh ingredients. The other from a cheap budget supermarket with cheap budget ingredients. Absolutely. And what better way to christen our new kitchen, our lovely new kitchen, than to do the most elaborate recipe in the world? Yep. Beans, beans on, on toast. toast. <laughs> I think it's a, way, it's a way of us finding our feet and also when we talked about doing our next cheap versus steep we had quite a lot of requests for this and we quite like the simplicity of it how like the ingredients can be so different in price but also the taste could be like for, for like a much smaller amount of money compared yeah. to where we've done we've done chocolate brownies on this playlist already yeah. and uh, was it mac, mac and cheese, cheese. Yeah. that was well, I would like the cheap ones. I've got cheap taste and you tend to like the expensive <laughs> yeah. ones. So we're going to make this beans on toast. They've been foraged in the shops and uh, let's see how we get on, yeah, right? Let's see. A high tech reveal. Let's go. <laughs> cheap, steep. Now the thing with cheap versus steep, of course you can elaborate and you could like really go max on the steep recipes with loads of elaborate ingredients and things like that. But it's about going one on one. So for example, to make beans on toast, I had to buy a loaf of bread uh, uh, in, in both circumstances, although this is only half a loaf, really. Yeah. <laughs> Look at it like that. Um, but we'll come on to it. The first thing, the most main thing, is the beans. The beans. The beans. The beans. The beans. The beans. Everyday essentials yes. from the supermarket. They were 22p. Wow. Yeah. I was so excited, I actually filmed a clip of me picking that off the shelf. I don't know why. I got these people looking at me in the supermarket, and I'm like, oh, I'm going to get my phone out. There's still social distancing in supermarkets, and they're like, so just wait there while I just film this on my phone. Yeah. Uh, action! <laughs> take three. Uh, these beans, so the, the supermarket didn't have their own brand, but these are 85p. 85p? Yeah, I think it was 85 Yeah. So almost, pretty much four times the price. See, I'm going to wonder what the difference is in beans. Surely a bean is a bean. I think it's all in the sauce, really. Actually, someone told me on Twitter, they sent me a link to a video where, um, in Western Supermare, where we live, there was someone that actually sold sure. baked beans for minus two pence because there was literally so much little profit in. The guy was doing it just to get rid of beans and get people in the shops to sell other things that he'd make his profit on. I'm just comparing the ingredients. Bring it. <laughs> I've been wanting to share that story for the last uh, few days. I know that pun as well. <laughs> <laughs> if you thought that was exciting, wait to find out about the bread. This loaf of bread, right, was 40 yeah. pence. And that's what? substantial. Like, you can get a lot out of bread. I, yeah. like, I like it a lot. This is, this is a standard medium sliced loaf for 40p. Brilliant. I feel that. That feels like... Uh, that feed us for a week. I will. Now, the complete opposite end of the spectrum. In fact, here's another fun clip of me picking it off the shelf. This Gosh. sourdough bread, which, it, hold it alongside that, let's see. It's about half the size, near enough. Yes. <laughs> wow. Three pound fifty. Three pound fifty. Three pound fifty. Oh. So how, how many 40 peas go in a three pound fifty? <laughs> well, four, three, four, eight, 120. Nearly nine, around that, because nine would be three pound sixty, wouldn't it? Nine times the price for some sourdough bread. Wow, <laughs> that's crazy! Cheap butter. <laughs> we just ruined our three pound fifty loaf. Cheap butter, one pound forty-five. Nothing wrong with that butter. Right? And as we found in the mac and cheese and the brownie videos, there are some more luxurious butters. I think we used this one before. This is um, from Crows, grazed on the lush grass of Normandy's mineral rich salt marshes uh, for £2.60. It's the same weight as the budget one. So there we go. And they're both salted. Um, this is butter really. But I don't normally add butter to my beans on toast. Oh, you gotta do that. The sauce is the butter. No, it soaks into the bread. Oh. Block of cheddar cheese, just standard mild cheddar. This is the cheapest one they do. This is the 
the one we always buy anyway. Yeah, but it, that's the thing. Like, you can get... It's all about balance, right? Yes. And then, like, some things don't matter. No, and then this one... Oh, my goodness. Like, the smell... That is a is smoked one, yeah. So strong. And it's £4.54. Yeah, so that, that is, is that £4.54. And that one, £1.79. So that... That is two and a half times the price of that. And they're the same weight as yeah, well. Yeah, it was on a got cheese it. wheel and I got the guy to cut it out so it was exactly <gasps> the same. Cheese wheel? Yeah. <laughs> That's proper posh. <laughs> Did he have his little cheese string thing as well and go Yeah. Like, I was um, gonna film him, but he looked like some he looked like Doc Brown at one point. He had all his like PPE on for oh, I hope it. he did. Yeah he did. Good. And then he literally gave me the cheese by his hand, I'm like, ah oh, thanks. So like, <laughs> he had his glove off. I just not remember that now. He's all PPE'd up to the max and then his hand literally touched mine. As long as he's there was a moment. I just had the ultimate decision to make of um, whether we cook the beans in the microwave, which to be honest, we normally always do. But because it's sort of cooking and we want to show you it, we'll do it on the hob and there might be some color difference. So we're going to have cheap one side and we'll do steep down the other end, all right? And just for reference, look, can you see in there? That's the dark kitchen that we used to film in. It's crazy. Look at the difference in the light. Nah, nah. Let's not go in there anymore. We're not going in there anymore. Oh, ladies and gents, uh, this is the drawer. Oh, it's so tidy. <laughs> you are not putting anything else in there. No well, gadgets. Yeah, but. <laughs> All the other gadgets are now in the garage sensible. So yes, they're still available. Survive for six months without them. We don't need them every day. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so let's put the beans in uh, to see if there's a colour variation here. That's what you paid extra for, look. <laughs> Just, Just the, the ring pool. That's what it's all about. You didn't have to buy a tin opener. Oh, the smell of cold baked beans. It's not green or anything. Oh, look. Oh, look. Yeah, look. Exactly. Very similar. Watch In out. fact, some might say they came from the same factory. <laughs> let's not go there. And that's it. Right. The life of a bean. All right, cheat this side. Yeah, in there you go. In there you go. We're getting the whole can in there. Oh, the sauce looks a bit different. Does it? It looks like thicker. In the consistency is thicker, is it? Oh, oh look, that sauce is runnier. Okay. And it doesn't look as dark as that one. Really? There is a compare. Oh yeah, I see it you slightly. See? I mean, to me, it's still orange. Oh, the smell of cold beans is possibly one of the worst smells ever. Uh, I like this setup, Mrs. B. This is very weird, isn't it? I've kind of got used to filming in there, but the great thing about our toaster as well is that we can actually toast both the types of bread at the same time. And as some of you guys suggested, they were like, oh, make sure you get some sockets down there. There you go. Yes. This is going to come in very handy indeed, because I love toasters, don't I? <sighs> oh, something's burning. Um, but people were saying about having ones that pop up out the counter. I don't like that, because I've just got like this vision. I'll be sort of lying there like going, hey. <laughs> <laughs> Mrs. B's got this thing with bread. The crust to her is like this most pointless thing. You will um, never eat a crust. I, I like, I don't have curly hair yet. I wonder if I get an afro when my hair grows back. Amazing. No. Who eats the end of a piece of bread? It's Who still bread. bread. It's quite, it's like, it's nice. Look, I'm not the only one. Who eats the crust? That smells really good. Does it smell worth £3.50 for the size of the bread? No, I, don't. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Have a look at what you could have won. That does look a lot nicer. It though. does, doesn't it? So we've got sourdough going in. Perfect. We can toast it exactly at the same time. And the other thing to look at is the cheese, and that's pretty much it. Mrs. B, you've forgotten your amazing toaster I'm tongs. Very excited. To I don't use even know these. we had these. No. I might have used them in a video. I can't remember. Very excited. Um, I feel very American with these. Really? Is that a weird thing? Yeah, because Americans always carry toast well, tongs no, with them. The first time I'd seen them was when we were in America, staying. Oh, was it? With a family. Yeah. All oh, right. And I was like, oh, what are these? And you were like, oh, oh my god. Really <laughs> Well, they're going to be perfect for this. I love that we can do both at the same time. This is awesome. It's slightly more golden crust on the sourdough as well. Very good. Where have you gone? So this is a, a block of mild cheddar cheese. Yes. Uh, we, we get that cheese. There's nothing else to say. It, it's, nope. it's cheese. It works. The kids don't complain and say that it tastes a pigeon or anything like that. It's all good. Now, as a comparison, this is the slab. Do you want to unravel that? It was in a wheel of Godminster Oak Smoked Cheese. So this is a cheese uh, place based in Somerset near us. Ooh, it's the what? <laughs> the what? That is very expensive Ooh. cheese indeed. But I'm sure if I went online, I probably could have got even more expensive and I'm probably gonna do that for the next cheap versus steep. 
Oh, it just smells like fire, doesn't it? It just smells like... Mm. It just smells like someone's barbecue in your pocket. Oh, that's, and then you want a bit of barbecue sauce over your beans as well. We're going gourmet now. Grating that cheese very close to your finger there, Mrs. B. Love that. Mm -hmm. Love a bit of digit in there. <laughs> you want too much to eat, Yeah, we? that would be great. Look at that. And the rind is okay. It's a little bit more mushy, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, get a oh, bit of plastic bag on there as well. That'd be great. <laughs> a bit, bit of finger in bit there. Skin, bit bit skin. plastic. <laughs> Let's reveal it. Ooh. Oh, like it's there a is a slightly more tangy colour looking on there, isn't it? Mm -hmm. I mean, it's probably the smoked edge mainly pushing that, but there is a. That's a little bit more mild and innocent. And that is stronger and tangier and smokier. I'm just going to open up this butter. And to be honest, that one's a little bit more milder in colour. Um, and it's butter. But maybe it will be the key player in this beans on toast. I mean, it's 25% of the ingredients, right? Yeah, guess. <laughs> I'm homeschooling our poor kids right now. Oh yeah, because it's four ingredients, it's 25%, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Mind blown. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Mrs. B, right, when she laughs, sometimes, she, you know the phrase, I wet myself laughing, she literally, I didn't realize that was a thing. Like she has to go. Yeah. Cheap versus steep. Should we, should we uh, get this yes. get, get, get going? Yes. yes. <laughs> do we have a cheap wooden spoon? We do. <laughs> we do. That's, that's, that's the one we've used for the dog food in the past. What? Don't use that. Do you use that for dog food or what? Maybe that should not be in there. <laughs> Maybe that shouldn't be in there. Oh. We've got our hob back. We've got our ovens back, it's so cool. Yay. You almost forgot how to use these ones. Yeah. Right, two sets of beans. We never you... cook beans on the hob, so. Never like, cook beans on the hob. Want you them have to cooked cold. beans on a hob. Put the toast on. The toast, okay. So we're going to go for a medium heat on both of these. So oh, kind? symmetrical toasting. All right, so the plates are ready. The toast is getting there. Then I'm going to be uh, picking them up in just a moment. Keeping these nice and hot. Oh my gosh. I think. Oh! I was just about to say, I think it's done. But why is one popped up and not the other? I pressed it down at exactly the same time. The oh. timer is exactly the same. I'm sure one's not slightly higher. I don't know. Oh, there we go. <gasps> it just all looks like toast now, doesn't it? <laughs> Ready? Yeah. Oh, the toast tongs. Wow. Hey. Okay. Wow. So it's steep. Cheap, yeah? Yeah. So we're buttering. Now that just smells expensive, that. I can't put my finger on it. Well, I can put my finger on it. Well, hey, I'm normally champing in the uh, cheap stuff, but I'm pushing on the uh, expensive here. A nice puddle of baked beans on top. Just enough. That looks identical, doesn't it? <laughs> it's yeah. just so simple. How can something so similar looking be so different in cost? We'll find out about the taste in a minute. Cheese, yeah. I'm only gonna go for a teeny little bit because I still wanna see a little bit of beans. Okay, and this is just an extravagant extra anyway. I mean, your generic basics is bread and beans. Okay, folks, cheap, steep. That, 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 to me, does that just look more expensive anyway? I can't put yeah, my finger on it. There's something it about it. Is it because there's um, a higher bean ratio? And the sauce Maybe. is, I the don't know. The sauce is like right off. <laughs> Even the cheese looks cheap. Look the way it's melted. Oh yeah, it's almost like a bed sheet. This is holding firm. It's yeah. like, yeah, I'm oak smoked. Nothing can defeat me. <laughs> I, think I think that, that one's the expensive. expensive. Really? Yeah. Why? Because the bread um, looks different. It looks to posh. Me. Right. It smells. And, the, and that's the cheap one. Yeah. All right, well, let's eat it before it gets cold. I'm, I'm going to eat this. Well, this yeah. piece. Right, Mrs. B, let's have yeah, a go. Can we have some? Oh. All right, should we go? We'll all go in at the same time. Oh, this one? Oh. Oh, gosh. Oh, my. Do you know what stands out the most to me? What? It's the bread. I was just going to say that. Yeah. That is amazing. Although the cheese is nice and strong. Yeah, there's a real tang. That bread mm. is really crunchy and... Yeah. Mm, really That's nice. The, that is oh. very nice. I like that. Oh, my gosh. Okay, right. I think the uh, steep could be on for the winner here. But is it worth 
four times the price. Ah. Oh. That was amazing. It's beans on toast though, that isn't it? That tastes of normal beans. That does taste of normal beans on toast, <laughs> yes. What we normally have. <laughs> Only thing with this one is the bread is soggy. Right, cheap or steep? Um, I really like them both, but steep. Steep? Yes. Mrs B? Steep. Steep. Chloe? Steep. Steep? You were cheap last time like me. These two were like similar, exactly. weren't you? Yeah, we were. And it was me and you. That's fine, I, I get it. Okay, so with 75%, eh? That's three yeah. quarters, Mrs. B. Yeah. Of the votes, <laughs> the steep is clearly going to win. But today, I want to go steep. I do. And the one steep element is the bread. That toast was phenomenal it was for amazing. me. Um, but I'm going to stay cheap because I can't justify spending that amount on beans on toast. Of course, it's for the whole ingredients, so you can do more with it. But I don't know, the, the beans? Beans didn't really taste yeah. much different. They, they didn't, did they? No. I'm going to go try them in a minute, cold. Brilliant. Mm. But you could um, top the, the bread. The cheese was richer, but you still got that gooiness from the standard cheese, yeah. right? And there's nothing wrong with that. So, cheap loses. Sadly. Sadly. <laughs> spend four times the amount on your beans on toast, apparently, I, family. I won't be doing that every week. Don't worry. No, okay. It's just for a one-off. Okay, so if you've got any ideas for future cheap versus steep videos, do let us know down below. This is a bit more of a simplistic one, but actually, in a strange way, with those four ingredients, I mean, forget about the butter. It's only 25%, right? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> it, it, like, really does make a difference. It so does. do let us know any ideas you've got down below, and we'll see you next time. Yes. Bye! Check your level player. No matter what your style, the kitchen's for me. Simon's moustache, goatee, maybe all three. Bonus scene. Right. <laughs> Hello. Chloe and I are going to actually try cold baked beans. These two don't want to do it. Oh, surprise. No. Right. Let's just try one. Me and Dad are going to man up. I've actually forgot which pan is which here. We are going to man up, Chloe. Good. <laughs> Mmm. Mm. Cold beans. Those are mm. really nice. They're quite, yeah, they're all right, aren't they? Let's try these ones. Oh, let's try these, um, yeah. Oh. Oh. Chloe, is it me or do they taste like more colder? Yeah. Do they taste cold, like yeah. like how cold baked beans smell and like? Yeah, they don't really, t these ones taste quite warm. But yeah. Those ones are quite. Mm. And the same temperature, by the way. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> There's more depth to those. Are they the um, expensive ones? I can't no. remember. No. So these are the cheap and these are the steep. Oh. Ah. Conclusion, Chloe and I like sugar. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. 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 Bye.